Hello. Um, a guy named Steven asked me a question on how to make a heart transparent in Photoshop. So I'm just going to do a real quick tutorial for him on how to do that. I'm going to start and paint. by making a heart downloaded it to my computer now I'm going to upload it to Photoshop okay so the hearts here in Photoshop go down here to the erase button and right click and then you'll see all these little things pick the the magic eraser tool and then just click in the middle of the heart and now that will be transparent now when you have this I assume you want to put a picture or something in back of this um, when you upload it to Zazzle, you'll have to put this on something white so you don't see the background here because I'll show you why. So let me show you if you upload a picture. You want it to be smaller than the white background. So that it doesn't shine to show through anywhere on Zazzle. See like that? You can just see her. So the problem is, is you can't make this part transparent. Because otherwise, you know, it'll show through all the way so you got to leave that part white just make sure you work on a white product unless you don't mind the white square showing and that's how you make it transparent you can also do something right here click on layer go to blending options and right here where it says opacity you can make it like this so it's a little bit transparent Again, I'll upload that picture, and then I'll show you a product where that was useful so you, that you know what I'm talking about or why I'm showing you this. I'm trying to get the heart on top there. So there you can see like a little bit. But you get the main gist of the picture you're trying to see. And I'll show you a product that I use this process on. So that's how you make a heart transparent. And then once you have this, um, you just save it to your computer. Click on File and click on Save As. As easy as that. Okay, now once you have your heart, I'll show you what you can do with it. So take a coffee mug, for example. Okay, click Customize this design. Upload images. Add the heart to your coffee mug or whatever product you're using. Get it centered. Okay, then find a picture you like.
Make sure it fits behind all the white of the heart. And move it to the back. Now, if you're making this mug for yourself, you don't have to do this part, but if you're making it for a customer you're trying to sell to, make sure you go down here and click on Make This a Template Object and toggle that on. That way the customer can add their own picture in. Move it to the back. Okay, now there's a picture of their dog. Of your dog, or if it's for a customer, they can add their dog in. And then you just click Done. And sell it. Or you can personalize it further. And you can put a name on there. And again, I'm going to click template so that the customer can edit that text. And that's what it's going to look like. Mm -hmm. Now, what I was talking about earlier with the white, like putting, making sure you put on a white product, because if you added a background color to this, this box will stand out. So anyway, way now you got that's how. So anyway, that's how you make a heart transparent. And then you just sell the product. Now, remember how we clicked make this a template. So when a customer clicks on personalize this template. They can change out and put their own dog's picture in there and add their own text in there. And I already see I forgot to make Casey a template. So I gotta click right here on that name mm -hmm. and make that a template too. Always double check. So see, now the customer can change a text right here. I'll show you what it looks like. They'll be able to see what they're making right there. And same with the picture. They can click on change and um, they can change out their picture too. So that's how you make a mug with a transparent heart. Hope that helped. Bye-bye. Thanks for your questions, Steve. Have a great day.